the music's very cinematic of like creating this sort of cinematic film to go alongside the music and The Wrong Crowd begins the whole story of the album and it begins with this with me sitting in this hotel room watching a video back of a relationship that he was in and very much in love and he's sat in the hotel room and, and he's kind of really screwed things up. It follows him on this journey to this party and he desperately, desperately does not want to be there. There's a shot of him in the mirror and he's shaking, he knows kind of symbolic of maybe not just a party, he's just in a place that he knows he shouldn't be in him, but he can't help himself. By the end of the video, it twists and he's there sort of overindulgently loving it. And there's champagne being poured on him. He might be smiling, but there's, you know, it's, um, he's crying on the inside, you know? And so it was just exploring that theme of sort of how that kind of hedonistic behavior can destroy something that is ultimately far more pure in his life. And George Belford, who directed them, really wanted me to do this scene where they were pouring champagne over me. First of all, I wasn't really sure whether I wanted champagne poured over me, and secondly, I thought maybe it was a bit too far. But they told me it wasn't champagne, and it, it was. And, uh, if you ever find yourself in that situation, it stings like hell. <laughs> and so I was sort of trying to sing the words into the camera, but I couldn't open my eyes. So I was like squinting, but it was quite funny. Yeah, overall it was enjoyable. The idea of the cheetah, the woman, which is actually across the artistic side of the album, keeps coming back. Cheetah is representing ultimately like the most, it's one of the most natural, be, you know, it's a natural animal and it's beautiful. It's almost like Mother Nature's uh, masterpiece. But then next, next to that, you have a, a, a woman that is, you know, beautiful and elegant in her own right, but showing that more side of things that isn't so pure, you know. And then there's a boy as well who was kind of representing the boy in the wrong crowd, who's sort of torn between both both worlds. But it was really interesting for me to have those three ideas going on in the same shot. And it's shot in an alcove and a cave represents like femininity and uh, it's long been symbolic of uh, almost like the womb and stuff like that. So we went into like a lot of detail over these things and what they represent because the wrong crowd is a lot about sort of family as well. And I like the fact that she could have also been passed as my mother, but you're not really sure because she's also very beautiful and looks quite young, but we went into a lot of detail. <laughs> but having the cheetah was, a, it was amazing and, and a terrifying experience uh, because it's such a force of nature. I mean, they're so big and um, such beautiful animals.